In this tutorial, we'll see some examples of variable precedence. This slide we have seen earlier when we looked into the playbook wars. Ansible reads variables from multiple locations. We have already seen how to read variables from inventory file, group wars, host wars, then how to add it in the playbook and how to add it in the play wars and read that variable. Then we have seen how to use include wars and set fact modules. If you are using same variable in multiple locations, Ansible relies on variable precedence order to determine the final variable value. And understanding variable precedence is crucial for writing reliable and effective playbooks and to avoid unexpected behavior in the playbook due to the variable change. This will even help you in prioritizing variable based on their scope. This is Ansible's variable precedence list. First, we'll take a look into inventory file group wars. Here, I already have a playbook. I'm going to use the host R2 and we'll try to add a variable called TACAX server IP. Currently, we don't have any variable with this name. If you try to run the playbook, We will get an error saying that variable is undefined. So we will set that in the inventory group inside wars of router. I will set the variable tagx server IP. I'll give 192.168.0.1. Save it. The host R2 is part of routers group. Now we'll try running the playbook. So now this is taking IP from inventory group. Now we'll see how to add this in the group wars all file. Here we already have a directory group wars. Under that in all, I will add this variable. And I'll change the IP to 2. So now this will have higher precedence. You can see now IP has changed to 0 0.2. Now we'll change this to playbook group wars. Now this group wars directory is inside inventory. I'll copy this. And we can even put this in the playbook directory. This is the playbook directory. Then inside that I have this file. And now I'll change the value to 3 here. So now this is playbook group wars. We'll try running the playbook. Now here IP has changed to 0 0.3. Now we'll see this option inventory group wars and we'll put it into routers group. So inside inventory. group wars routers and i'll put it here i'll change the ip to 0 0.4 the group name was routers so we'll try running so now this has changed to 0 0.4 Same like this, we can go to the playbook group wars inside routers. Here I'll put 5. 
will run the playbook. Now this has changed to 5. Now we have seen these two options. Now we'll see how to set this inventory file. We'll go to the inventory file. Under R2, I'll set the variable. I'll set this as 6. Now we'll run it and value has changed to 6. Next we'll see play wars. Same like previous example, we can even put it into the inventory host wars and test it. Now we'll see how to use play wars. I'll open the playbook. Here I'll give wars and this time I'll give 7. So now IP has changed to 7. Next we'll see how to use play wars file. files and here we already have a file wars and I'll put the data here and I'll change this to 8 and here we need to give servers dot yaman save it and we'll try running now ip has changed to 8 so it is taking from the wars files next we'll see how to use include wars so here i'll create a task include wars and we'll give file we had a file earlier agency underscore wars underscore demo then route underscore inc dot yaml I'll put the data here and I'll change this to 9 save it now we'll try running the playbook now value has changed to 9. Now we'll use set fact. I'll copy this. I'll give 10 here we'll try running the playbook so now IP has changed to 10 the last option we'll try extra wars extra wars is having the highest precedence For that we can give hyphen e then the variable name i 
and here instead of colon we need to give equal to and i will give ip 11 we'll try running the playbook now ip has changed to 11 this is one example of how variable precedence works in ansible